Are you feeling helpless, lost, wondering what to do when you just stumble upon your homework and it says that you have to find a tangent to a curve? Well, today, I'll be showing you how to find a tangent to a curve and not only that, how to find the normal as well. Let's just say we have the curve y equals to 2x to the power of 2 minus 7x plus 3. Let's just say the tangent to this curve is parallel to the line y equals x plus 2. First, we have to differentiate it. dy dx. As you can see, the power of 2 is multiplied to 2 and becomes 4x and you lose a 2. Because there's no power here, it's just 7. As you know, the tangent is parallel to the line y equals x plus 2. This means that the tangent to this curve has the same gradient, which is 1. The dy dx gives you the, the gradient of the tangent to this curve. Therefore, dy dx equals to 1. This means that 4x minus 7 equals to 1, 4x equals to 8, and x in turn equals to 2. Therefore, this means that the x value is 2. Ha ha! We have made progress now. Now, we have to find the equation of the tangent. As you already know, the tangent is parallel to this. Therefore, it will be y equals x plus c. As you already know this, we can find the y value. The simplest way to do this is to put 2 into x. To do this, x becomes 2. And this gives you, in turn, y equals 2 minus 3. As you already know this, you can find c very easily. Plot it back into this. Or, if you want a harder method so that you can solve the normal easier, you can use the y minus y1 equals to m x minus x1 formula. This means that y plus 3, because this is a negative, equals to 1 x minus 2 from here. See this? Therefore, we will get in turn y equals 2 x minus 5. This, ladies and gentlemen, is your tangent. Now, how do we find the norm? You may think it's difficult, but it's actually very easy. The normal is perpendicular to the tangent. This means that the gradient is the negative reciprocal of this. Therefore, we know as this was 1, the negative reciprocal will be negative 1 over 1, which is 1. They also follow the same values because they touch the same point. This means that it's 1 plus 3 because it's a negative x plus 2, no, minus 2, sorry. Then we solved it. And there is your normal. So I hope that I've helped you today in finding the tangent and normal to your curve. See ya.